Hello YouTube, it's the Brick Adjuster here with another episode of Playing with Lego. Today we have a special guest. We have Little Buskis. Little Buskis. Today we will be reviewing a Lego DC superhero set. This is Batman Scarecrow Harvest of Fear. It's set number 76054 and it has 563 pieces. So here we go. Enjoy. A good boy. The first minifigure we have is Batman. Batman. And this is a new Batman with a gas mask so he doesn't get toxic, intoxicated with the fumes from the harvester. But we have a new torso which isn't yellow. It's kind of like a lime green. And even his abs are outlined in green. And when you take off his cowl, you can see that he also has a different face with a gas mask. Batman also comes with a green bandana, so when you put this on like this, now he has green eyes. Very cool for Batman. And Batman's back, oh that's different too. So look at that back torso printing there for Batman. Next up we have Blue Beetle, Blue Beetle another minifigure that we haven't gotten before. And it's pretty cool, I like the face there, it's nice printing, even the torso has nice printing. We'll get rid of this so you can see the torso better. He comes with wings. And I'm not sure what shade of blue that is, but it's like a trans clear tint of blue on those wings. Very nice. And he even comes with this armor. Here we have Killer Moth. Killer Moth. Another new minifigure that we haven't gotten before. Look at those striped legs that kind of remind me of the Cheshire Cat. He has a purple torso with a little bug on his chest and a cool looking mask. If you take the mask off, this is how he looks without the mask. So, just a regular guy with sunglasses. Killer Moth also comes with an alternate face where he is scared. And that face kind of looks cartoony to me. Like a scared. Kind of reminds me of Scooby-Doo characters maybe. And then we have the wings. So those are nice trans orange wings there so killer moth is a keeper mm -hmm. and here we have scarecrow. scarecrow and this scarecrow looks like a woman with the hat and the hairpiece but if you take the hat and hairpiece off you can see it's an awesome looking headpiece with stitches on the mouth stitches on the forehead and across the face looks really nice and then if you turn scarecrow around you can see even has stitches on the back of his head so this is a nice looking minifigure, great torso as well, minus the hair and the hat. And the last minifigure we have is the farmer. the farmer. And this is a scared looking farmer. You can see he's wearing a wife beater there with some mud on his fat belly. He even, you can see his belly, oh you can't see his belly button, but his shirt is too tight for his big belly. And when you take off his hat. You can see his face a bit better, looks very scared. And he does come, no, no alternate face, nothing, blank face. But that is the farmer, let's turn him around. Oh, there's also mud on the back of his torso. So here's the main build and this is the combine harvester for this set. And actually it's a pretty nice build with some play features. Here's the first play feature when you roll it turns in the front. However, when you go backwards, it's a little choppy. But I guess this vehicle is supposed to only meant to go forward. Uh, what else? In here we have some, I don't, I'm not sure what it is. Stuff for the bad guy, stuff for Killer Moth or um, the Scarecrow. But this reminds me of something out of Galaxy Squad with the, with the bugs. Uh, these are stickers over here. And I guess farmer or character would go in there. We have little, I guess they're like exhausts where the fumes come out. And we have a nice little pipe that goes around to the front. But overall, nice vehicle. Here's a feature. 
these little green things. They're actually stud shooters, so let's put it in. So it is here in the stud shooter, and now we can fire these at people. Fire away. We also get a bat copter with a huge propeller that spins like so. And this bat copter also has a feature. So let me show you the feature. Well, let's see the sides first. So here's the sides. We got a sticker over there. Here's the back view. A lot of studs over here, but that's okay. All right, I'll show you the feature. So the feature is when you push this in, the gunners pop out like that. And so, let's do that again. We'll push this in, and the gunners pop out. And these are just stud shooting missiles that shoot out. And we just have some decoration missiles over here. That's a nice little feature. And then the cockpit opens up, and you can stick Batman in there. Nice little vehicle. Out here is probably the best build out of the three, and it is the tractor. It's the smallest build, but it's the most cannon. We have a lot of nice slopes here to make everything look smooth. And let's get the farmer out so you can see it a bit better. We have a little chair. It's a very nice, very nice tractor. And then we can even attach a carriage in the back for this tractor. And some pipes here. Okay, nice. And a sticker. A couple stickers. Little buskets. What? What's your favorite part of the set? My favorite part of the set is that you could uh, put the farmer inside here. Oh. And and, uh, and the scarecrow can uh, uh, break his jacket. Oh, no. <laughs> so you like the combine harvester, this vehicle? Yeah. What else do you like about this vehicle? What's cool about uh, it? I like the, th this You could thing. like how this turns? Yeah, and, and then you could get this guy stuck. Oh, no. What's your favorite minifigure? Uh, Killer Moth. Killer Moth. And what would you rate this set out of 10? Uh, 8. 8 out of 10. My favorite part of the set would have to be the tractor. I really like this tractor. Looks really nice. I'm going to keep it built. And I like the minifigures. I like how we get the Blue Beetle. And we get Killer Moth. Scarecrow. That's okay. Not sure if I like the hair piece and the head. But the face looks awesome. And we get a new Batman variant torso. So that's always nice to have. If I were to rate this set, I would say just part it out, but keep the minifigures. So this concludes this episode of Playing With Lego. This is the Brick Adjuster with Little Buskers. Signing off. Thanks for watching and we will see you guys in another video. Bye.